are largely distorted or inflated by crazy fans campaigns, fans supportive campaigns for their idol. Okay. So, uh, and that led to a phenomenon which called the traffic artist phenomenon. So the okay. artist is not judged by his true talent or his works, but by his popularity, by his influence to, uh, of how large following he have and, and, and his fan supportive campaigns. And, uh, uh, since the cleanup campaign that the government has, um, has launched, uh, uh, we think that the tra- traffic worship has been largely content. Okay. Mm-hmm. That a, makes sense. A background thing of this. Mm-hmm. That's okay. really interesting, yeah. Mm. Yeah. Continue, please. Okay. Then, <laughs> uh, yeah, so, so, uh, we observe this, uh, from, from a short term. It might bring down revenues for, for some artists and for some platforms. But in a long run, longer run, we, we believe it's a possible, it's a, it's a chance for the industry to shift from the traffic worship um, to, you know, uh, to, to value the quality content, a mm. return to the, the, the core, which is the, the content, mm. the content matters. Yeah, that makes sense. Bring it back to the songs and the, the records, I guess. Exactly, exactly. Yeah. 纵观这五到十年呢，呃，每年的市场上出现的优秀内容少之又少，更多的人只注重流量本身，但对品质呢，就是很少跟进。我认识很多的这个优秀的歌手和音乐人嘛，啊，他们有很多很棒的作品，